What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven. Welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we defeated Erica, the Celadon City Gym Leader. We got 12 badges. That's pretty cool. Pretty gnarly. We can't show it right here on my, my thing, but here's the proof. Yes, 12 badges and all. Yes, I feel happy. I feel great. Oh, God, I really don't like this next part right here. Yeah, you guys already know that we're going to Fuchsia City. It's a done deal right there. I, I really don't like going to Fuchsia City because either way it's just hectic. It's ridiculous. So uh, we're going to choose the cycling roadway and then uh, getting out of Fuchsia City we're going to go the other way, you know, the long way. That place. So here we are, Route 16. Talk to this guy. He's like, cycling road starts here. It's all downhill so it's totally exhilarating. It's the greatest sort of feeling that you can't get from a ship or a train. Alright, okay. Kind of like the X Games. Okay, so you, there was a lot of trainers right here, but not anymore. And, uh, well, there you can actually find Pokemon right here. I think you can find them. I think you can find, like, a... What was it? What was that Pokemon called? I can't remember what Pokemon... Uh, shoot. You can find some Pokemon right here, yes. Uh, how many Pokemon trainers are here? I do not know. Maybe not a lot. Holy crap, there's not a lot of trainers here? What the hell? Where are the trainers? Oh, there you are. Okay, uh... Wow, that's a cool bicycle. Yeah. Yeah, I completely forgot about this. Okay, so Biker Joel wants to battle and he's got himself Butthead. I mean Magmar. Butthead Magmar. Coming out with my buddy old, my good old buddy Cinder. Alright, Cinder, let's do this. Big Daddy Cool Cinder right here is going to kick some butt. Butthead right here is just not going to do anything because he's Cinder. Or Butthead. He's Butthead. And that dig attack does the job. Yes, it does. Heck yes. Heck yes. That's right. Oh, yes. And I gave Cinder the experience here because, hey, you know, we got a lot of tough more, uh, a lot more battles coming through. So let's go ahead and use Nessie now because it's been a while. Let's go, Nessie. Bring it. Alrighty, another butt hit right here, and uh, we're going to go with a Surf Attack. Look at that. Surf Attack for the win. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. Easy victory for us right there. Okay. Alright, so Joel has been defeated, and uh, he's like, but you don't just look cool. Okay, I don't care. I don't care. I, I, I really don't care. I'm going to go down. Um, huh. Okay, I'm just going to battle this guy. I really... We're fearless highway stars. I, I really... Honestly, guys, I really don't want to battle any of the other potential trainers that are here. So, I'm just going to go downhill here and get to Fuchsia City because we got shit to do here. So, he's coming out with coughing. And I'm coming out with my cinder. Let's leave it like that. And, uh... Uh, let's go with the fi fire punch right here. Oh, uh, yeah. Coughing. Defeated. Coughing's been eliminated, and, uh... Alright, Cinder's getting more experience points just for the minute, and he's coming out with his, uh, chameleon. I mean, charmeleon. Let's go with Nessie right here. Nessie's got this. Because Nessie's Nessie. He's cool. Calm, collected. That kind of stuff. And, uh... Well, we're going with that surf attack. Alrighty. Alrighty, alrighty. Look at that. Yeah, I think I think we're we're good enough to be the Pokemon League champion and whatnot. And he's gonna come out with his wheezing. Okay, let's go to the man, the myth, the legend, or you know, to the guy that we overpowered just a little bit. Yeah, we're going with uh Relic. Dun dun dun. Alright, Relic. Do your thing, Psychic. Alrighty, okay. Alrighty. There goes that wheezing. Defeated just like that. Alrighty, alrighty. Okay. Biker Charles has been defeated, and he's like, ah, crash and burn. Yes, it is, a crash and burn. Bye! Okay. So we're out of Suckling Road just like that. Wow, that was quickly. Second round uphill starts here. I am not going uphill. Alrighty, and uh, let's see. Route 18, Celadon City to Fuchsia City. And, uh, well, it looks like we have more Pokemon battles. Let's go with a guy that we haven't seen in a while. K 
Kid Thunder because we've been replacing him left and right with uh, Razor. How many Pokemon trainers are here? Not just one. Oh, wow. Okay. Bring it! If you're not looking for Pokemon, you have to look in the tall grass. Okay. Alrighty. Let's see. Let's see. He's, we got a bird keeper named Burris. And then, all right, let's go, Burris. Let's do this. It's coming out with his Dodua. All right, Dodua. You wanna, you want a piece of me? Let's go. Dodua, meet my Kid Thunder right here. Kid Thunder, do that thing that we always do to bird Pokemon. Yeah, Thunderbolt attack. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> That's it. Look at that. Look at that. And. uh... Okay, so what? Wait, he's got. Oh crap. Oh, he's coming out with his Doug or his Doug Trio. All right. Here we go. Thunderbolt attack, and yes, I am faster than Doug Trio, so it's kind of scary right there. I was kind of scared, but this Doug Trio right here just scary. Probably one of the best uh, bird Pokemon in Kanto. And uh, well, he's only got Doug Duos. Not good, man. Not cool. All right, finish him off, Thunderbolts. Oh yes. And uh, okay, alrighty, alrighty. There we go. Defeated. Alrighty. So that's it. That's pretty much it for that guy. And he's like, hey, okay, whatever. I am not gonna talk to you because you might want my phone number. And uh, wow. This guy wants to battle. Cycling Road is quick shortcut to Saladon City. Yes, it is. A really quick shortcut. I thought it was going to be like quick, like super quick. This guy, his name is Bob. Bob the Builder wants to come out with his Noctowl right here. And this Noctowl looks menacing. So this guy's probably from Johto. Probably. I don't know. Thunderbolt. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's that Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt does the, the rest right there. Heck yes. Oh yes. Defeated. Alright. And uh, there goes Bob and he's like, oh, woohoo! Okay. I'm not going to talk to you either. Okay, here we are. Fuchsia City. Look at that, guys. And, uh, okay. This is home to the Fuchsia City Gym, of course. We're going to be going in here. Uh, the gym leader is named Janine, not uh, Koga anymore. Of course, we defeated Koga in the Pokemon League. Uh, this was, what, the house of Bill? Let's see. My grandpa is at my brother Bill's, uh, on Cerulean, on the Cerulean Cape, yes. This is Bill's place. I saw these weird, uh, slow Pokemon on the cycling road. Hmm. Slow Pokemon. Okay. Uh, okay, so we're gonna heal up some, some stuff right here, and, uh, gonna take a small tour, and then continue on with our adventure. That's right. Heal my Pokemon. Okay. Alright. So, three years has passed by, and uh, one of the things that, one of the major changes that has happened over here in, in Kanto is the shortcut to Cinnabar Island. Now, if you go right, well, if you go right here, it's like, please be careful if you are swimming uh, to Seafoam Islands. Fuchsia City Police. Okay, um, not that, but if you go down here, there's going to be a few people talking about the Cinnabar Island incident. Cinnabar's volcano erupted. It hurled boulders that cut off Route 19 indefinitely. I wonder if the people of Cinnabar are safe. Hmm. Something happened. And as you can see, this place is blocked off by these boulders right here. And it talked to this guy. He's like, sorry, this road is closed for construction. If you want to if you want to get to Cinnabar, you'd better get uh, go south from Pallet Town. Huh. And this guy's like, who knows how long it would take uh, take us to move these boulders. Okay. It's going to take you guys a while. I know that for a fact. So, you can't do anything right here. And uh, we're going to continue on our adventure. Our tour of Fuchsia City. Now, this right here is the Safari Zone Warden's house. Or Warden's home. And, again, three years have passed by. And the lady right here is like, my grandpa is a Safari Zone Warden. At least he was. He decided to go on a vacation and took off overseas all by himself. He quit running the Safari Zone just like that. Huh. So you mean to tell me that there is no Safari Zone anymore? Jesus, okay. Um, okay, I don't know. We, we should check for ourselves and I 
Don't know why I'm not riding my bike here. Uh, let's see. One, oh, yeah. One of the Elite Four uh, used to be uh, the leader of the... Well, let me read that again. Wow. One of the Elite Four used to be uh, the leader of the Fuchsia City Gym. Yeah, that's true. That is so true. And there's a notice here. Safari Zone office is closed until further notice. Huh. And Fuchsia City... Behold the Passion of Pink. And, uh... Well... Wow, this is empty. Wow. Okay, I don't know. Okay. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, crud. We need... We need Razor. Crud. We need Razor. Okay. The dreaded trees of doom right here. We need to eliminate them. So we're going to go back to the Pokemon Center and get ourselves Razor in exchange for you-know-who... Kit Thunder. All right, let's go back to Kit Thunder. I'll see you just in, in just a little bit, buddy. I promise you, just a little bit. And we got to go back to this guy right here. Razor. Laser. Blazer. Misha. Okay. And this is just like uh, this is just for the, uh, the the tour of Fuchsia City. So let's go back up right here and uh, destroy this tree of doom. Or the Tree of Might, you know, like in Dragon Ball Z. You know, Turles and all that. And, let's see, talk to this girl. She's like, the Safari Zone is closed and it's sad. Considering it's Fuchsia's main attraction. It was. Now it's not. And no littering. Please take your waste with you. And if you guys remember, there used to be Pokemon right here. Like Kabuto, Omanyte, Kangaskhan. I guess they were all released and all that stuff. And uh, talk to this guy. Koga's daughter succeeded him as the gym leader after he joined the Elite Four. Huh. And, well, would you take a look at that? There's no door. They just took away the door. They got lazy and took away the door. The warden is traveling abroad. Therefore, the safari zone is closed. Wow. You know, you could have made that girl the, the warden. You know, that kind of stuff. Luckily that we have Pokemon, uh, Pokemon Soul Silver and uh, Leaf, or Pokemon Soul Silver and Heart Gold. That takes care of everything, right? I think so. And uh, let's see, there's nothing right here. There used to be a Chansey right here. Oh wow, it has changed. This place has changed a lot. Okay. Um, okay, there's nothing really for us to do. I'm not gonna make this. Uh, I'm not going to make this episode boring. So we're going to go back to the Pokemon Center, and uh, we're going to grab ourselves Kit Thunder because we got a little bit of a, a business to take care of right here. So let's take care of this. Uh, okay, thank you, Razor, for your help. I am going to go back to Kit Thunder because, you know, we have an adventure to take care of. Hydra 2 is there, and uh, where are you, Kit Thunder? Kit Thunder, there you are. By the way, I did not name that Machop Muscle. You think I, I think I already showed you guys how to trade for that Pokemon. And, uh, alrighty. Okay, so we're in the gym right here, and here's the only guy that's ever believed in us, and he's like, yo, champ in the making. Whoops. I'll take a look around. Uh, the trainers all look like uh, the leader Janine. Which of them is the real Janine? I don't know. Let's see. Oh, well. Uh, so to get around this place, if you guys can tell, there's dots right here. That is, you know, that signifies the walls, the invisible walls that are around here. Um, just take a look at that, and you'll be able to find Janine in all her glory. Uh, by the way, that is not Janine. Uh, let's see. Now, she is a poison-type gym leader, so go ahead and use uh, your psychic-type Pokemon or ground-type Pokemon. So I'm going to be going with Relic right here. And uh, we're going to be battling this chick here first. Fooled you! Ha ha ha! Yeah, it wasn't that easy. If we would have found Janine, it would have been hilarious. So hilarious. Alright, bring it on. Let's go. Alright, let's go. She's coming out with her Bulbasaur. I'm coming out with Relic because Relic has Shadow. Or has Psychic Attack. Scratching my ear. That's all I'm doing. And that Bulbasaur is gone and down for the count. Bye bye Cinder's just, you know, gaining levels. And she's coming out with a Venusaur. Okay, all right, let's go, let's go. Okay, we're going to go with Cinder right here. We're going to use everybody. Just about everybody for this. All right. Let's go. Cinder. Cinder. Use that fire punch tank that I, I taught you. All righty, all righty. Fire punch. 
destroys. There we go. Look at that. And, uh, hello, level 55. Cinder just keeps on growing. And, uh,. Well, she's coming out with her Ivysaur. I'm going to give somebody else a chance right here. I'm going to go with Nessie, since it is a nice type too. You know, ice types over grass types. You know, the whole shebang right there. The shibubu and the shebang bang. All right, let's go. Ice beam. Oh, yeah. You didn't like that. You really didn't like that. And there's that super effective move. And, uh, okay, all righty. Last Linda has been defeated, and she's like, oh, I lost. You're not weak. Uh, no. Pokemon League Champion, come on. Pokemon League Champion. Two-time Pokemon League Champion on his way. All right, how are you doing? I'm Janine. How'd you know I, or how did you know I was, I was real? Let's battle. That's not really Janine, guys. She's just a fake. All right. So here we go, Picnicker Cindy coming out with her Needle Queen. All right, bring it, just bring it. With Relic, Relic, go with that Psychic Attack. Oh yeah, Psychic Attack does a lot of damage. So much more damage that you know what you just don't know, you don't feel it, you don't, you know, you can't expect it. And uh, alrighty, Picnicker Cindy has been defeated. Darn it, I wanted to win. Yeah, we all did too. Alright, that's two down. I'm just gonna battle every single one of these girls right here. Here we go. Wow! <laughs> you betcha, I'm Janine! Again, guys, they're just screwing around with you. They're just making fun of you. Alright, so here we go. Camper Barry wanting to battle us, and uh. Alright, coming out with his Needle King. Alright, bring it on. Here we go. Psychic attack. That's right. <laughs> Didn't expect that to happen, huh? Mm. For the win. I'm drinking water, by the way, guys. I'm sorry. Thirsty. A lot of talking. Lots and lots of talking right here. And uh, there goes Camper Barry. He's like, my disguise was right on. Dang. All right. I'm not even going to question that. I'm just going to walk away. And I'm going to talk to you. And she's like, foo foo foo. I'm Janine the gym leader. No, I'm not. Gotcha, sucker. Alright. Okay. Kind of getting a little sick of you guys' shit here. So, let's go with uh, Gloom. And I'm going to go with uh, Relic. That's right. Psychic attack. Now, if you guys remember, in Pokemon Yellow. This gym wasn't exactly all poison type Pokemon. It was more of like, you know, psychic type Pokemon, and psychic type Pokemon that knew how to use uh, knew how to use uh, poison type attacks. You know that kind of stuff. It was that kind of gym, and uh, thankfully Janine actually bought this in order right here. And we're gonna go with another psychic attack right here. Look at that. That's right. There we go. There we go. Okay, okay, alrighty. And here we have another Gloom. I'm just gonna take care of this Gloom with the uh, Relic right here. That's right, looking really, really nasty, disgusting and everything. Look at that, look at that. There we go. As you can see, victory for us. V for victory and she's like, I had you fooled. No, you really didn't. I knew that it wasn't you. I mean, I just... Look at that. Look at that. That's Janine right there. That's not Janine. Okay, so let's go to Janine right here and... Foo -foo 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 -foo. I'm sorry for the, to disappoint you. I'm only joking. I'm the real deal. Janine of the Future City Gym. That's me. Bring it on, woman. She's very short on words right here. So here we go. Janine, the actual gym leader. And she's coming out with her Crobat. All right, all right. Let's do this. Okay, so Janine, the gym leader right here, going into our next screen. Uh, yeah, she she's the daughter of Koga. Remember, Koga had all these other Pokemon. We're not discussing Koga. We're going to go right here with 
Janine, the beauty ninja queen right here. And she does have five Pokemon, starting off with Crobat at level 36. It does have Wing Attack, Confuse Race, Supersonic Screech. Then we got two Weezings at level 36. Each one of them has Sludge Bomb, Toxic, Smog, Explosion. And then you got Ariados at level 33. It has String Shot, Nightshade, Giga Drain, and, and uh, Scary Face. And then she finishes it off with Venomoth at level 39, Toxic, Psychic, Double Team, and Supersonic. Now, she is one of the weakest of the gym leaders around here because she's pretty new. So, moving on to our next screen right here. Let's go. Psychic. Look at that. It's very easy to defeat this gym leader right now because, you know, it's poison. Uh, some of them are bug type. You know, you can use a fire type, a psychic type, you know, the whole shebang, ice type, Pokemon, that kind of stuff. And uh, let's see, what does she bring out? She's going to come out with her area though. So I'm going to squish it. I'm going to squish it with my Cinder. Cinder. Alright, bring it. We're going to go with Cinder. Because Cinder can do this. Fire Punch. Fatality. You know, I'm kind of getting into Mortal Kombat, you know, that stuff. It's pretty cool. That stuff. And, uh... Alrighty, more experience points from this guy right here, and he's coming out with the wheezing. Okay, I'm gonna go with a Teddy because Teddy, you know, it's been a while. Look at that wheezing. Now remember, Teddy does have earthquake attack. All right, let's go with the return because it is very, very powerful. And say bye bye to wheezing. Oh yes, Teddy just destroying everybody and is she coming out with her other yes she's coming out with another wheezing I'm gonna stay with this guy right here all right do it return attack alrighty okay alrighty alrighty and uh, okay she's gonna be coming out with her Venomoth right here I'm gonna go Straight to the man, the man, the, the, the legend, Kid Thunder. You can beat him in both ways. Yeah, little does this uh, Venomoth realize Kid Thunder has a secret weapon. That's right. Has this attack. Fire punch. And it's equipped with a charcoal, so let's go. Ah, uh, yes. The burning sensation of Venomoth eliminated. Just like that. Oh, yes. That's right. And, uh, well, just like that, Janine's been defeated. You're, you're a tough one. You definitely won. Here's a soul badge. Take it. Mm-hmm. All right. Here we go, guys. Another badge. The soul badge. You're so tough, I have a special gift. It's toxic. It's powerful poison that uh, steadily snap, uh, saps the victim's HP. So I was wrong in the last episode, yeah, we do get another TM, and it's from Janine, and it's the Toxic Technique. I'm going to really apply myself to improve my skills. I want to become better than both my father and you. Alright. She's pretty cool. She's she's a pretty cool person. That's cool. Alright. I like this. I like this. Alright, so we're feeling a little heavy. 14 badges total. Yeah, that, oh no, I actually, wait, 14, 15, 16. No, we got 13 badges. Wow. I just, wait, wait, wait. We, I completely forgot about this guy. Sorry, bro. That was a great battle trainer from Johto. Okay. Never mind. Okay, so... That's pretty much it, guys. Um, In the next episode, we're going to be going to the dreaded route that I don't like. <sighs> yeah, we're going to go to that dreaded route. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned, guys. Uh, 14, 15, no, 13 badges in total. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next episode. See you guys.